Hi, my name is Jody, and I'm a physiotherapist with many years' experience helping people choose and size walking aids. And I'm Sarah Doherty. I'm an occupational therapist and co-founder of Side Sticks Ventures, Inc. I've been on walking aids, crutches, for 37 years. And Side Sticks is customizable both to your height and to your weight. Today we're here to demonstrate how to set up your side sticks once you have them so that they'll perform optimally for you. In order to do that, it's a good idea to have someone help you, and that's why I'm here. Because <laughs> if Sarah was going to measure herself, it would be difficult to hold the position and then look down and measure. It's a little like trying to measure yourself for clothing. You always get a seamstress to help you. So the first thing you want to do is stand up as comfortably as you can. Mm -hmm. so here I am, and I have a walking shoe on that I usually walk with. Once you're standing, you want to just maintain an easy posture with your arms. Just let them hang loose and comfortable. Okay. The person helping you is then going to mark where your wrist crease is. Okay, and you, that's just the point where the wrist bends. You then want to set up your walking stick so that the part where you put your weight should line up directly with that wrist crease. Now I'm going to give Sarah back her crutch and when she puts it on and puts weight through it, I'll get her to turn so that you can see, that puts her arm at a nice soft angle. It's slightly bent about 20 degrees or so, but not fully straight. That's the best angle for weight bearing and allowing shock absorption through the joints without causing a lot of trauma to the joints. Essentially, if you measure this way, you're going to put yourself at the best biomechanical advantage for energy efficiency, joint protection, and comfort. And that's basically what we wanted to get across today. Thanks, Jody, for sizing me. Feels good. You're welcome. Happy wandering. Thanks.